National Commander Daniel Seehafer paid a visit to our great state over the last two days, though his first stop was in Elkins last night. 12 News' Jalen Lamp met with Commander Seehafer and has the story for us now. During his world tour, American Legion National Commander Daniel Seehafer made a stop in West Virginia on Tuesday at American Legion Post 29 in Elkins. As a part of his mission, Seehafer learned about the community and spoke on the importance of being the one. And what we talk about when we say be the one, we're all gathering together over three million of our family members uh, with the American Legion is trying to lower that suicide rate within our family, within the veteran rank and also uh, affecting the families as well. We say be the one, be the one to ask, be the one to reach out, be the one to listen. In addition to the visit, Elkins American Legion also celebrated its 105th anniversary welcoming in a few new and familiar faces. In his speech, Seehafer touched on the importance of love and acceptance within the veteran community, supporting one another as a genuine family. Reaching out with that, with that message that, you know, we can be the one and really be the one to make a difference. You know, we know about those uh, numbers and, and there's all, their numbers are all over the place, 17, 18, 22 per day. Some reports can go over 40 to 44, 50 people per day. That's just way too many. We would say one is way too many. And then to know that a suicide can affect 50 to 100, up to 150 people, join our ranks, come and be a part of the family. Seehafer continued his travels in West Virginia on Wednesday, visiting Clarksburg and Morgantown as well. Next up for the National Commander is a trip to Vermont. Your viewers, you yourself, you're worth it. My service, you're worth it. But the big thing is this, that we continue to serve. And we serve our, our communities, our youth, children, um, and each other. Reporting from Elkins with 12 News, I'm Jalen Lamp.